A drag performer with a decades long history on stage says the spotlight is why she's aging well. Yeah, Brandy Lee has a day job as a receptionist, but still takes singing gigs on the side. Our Diana Co tells us what the glitz and glam means to her. Glade Show Club in Chinatown, a popular female impersonation bar on Hotel Street, opened in 1963 with the help of choreographer Brandy Lee. I was the one who put the drag show together. This was Lee when she coordinated and danced in the productions, which started during such a difficult time to be LGBTQ. I liked it because I love, I like show business, but my purpose in doing it at that time, because we came out at a time when it was really uh, bad for Mahus at that time on the street. You weren't allowed to be in drag on the street. You would get arrested or beat up or whatever. In 1963, a new state law criminalized cross-dressing. Mahu had to wear this I am a boy button to avoid arrest, which often opened them up to attacks. I said, you know, we need, we need to, I, I feel like we need to get some kind of dignity or respect. So I said, the only venue that I think that we can change people's image and outlook of us was show business stage. Because, you know, people like celebrity. <laughs> Aloha, Epic Ohana, Brandy speaking. How may I help you? Here, over six decades later, okay, Lee still easily table. recalls so the pain and anger of the humiliation. It sounds like you're still hurt. I am. <laughs> I am, but I'm happy now because so many doors have opened up for people. Before, you couldn't walk out of your house without getting a, some kind of altercation or abuse. The Glade had the first professional drag show in the state, and it was such a success. It's one of the key building blocks in Hawaii's slow acceptance of mahu that this generation benefits from. They don't realize what we had to go through for, so they could do what they do today. It's not the pale moon that excites me, that thrills and delights me. Oh, At no, 82, no. Lee still takes to the stage. Like making people happy, you know? I want to take them out of, for, for a couple of hours, out of their, their humdrum life or their misery or if, what problems they're going through, and just forget about it so they can de-stress and then they can go back and handle it. Then, and now, Lee leans on the healing power of music to bring joy to herself and others. Diana Ko, Island News. It definitely tells she's a performer. Mm -hmm. Awesome.